All right, we're on an adventure today. We're going to a place I've never been before. And I have, come here, come here. I have a new co-pilot today with me. Come here, say hi everybody. We're going on an adventure. Yeah, I have Colt with me today. We're gonna go on an adventure. So stick around. We're going into a store I've never been to, but they got some good deals from what I've been told. So we're going. All right, so we are in Atlanta, Michigan. Mm, 45 minutes from the house, 45 miles from the house. Um, I know it don't look like much. I actually drove by it and had to turn around and come back. Um, it's a marathon gas station that has a big grocery store attached to it. So let's go in and see what kind of deals we can find. All right, I did not film in the store because you really wouldn't have seen much because it's so compact with a bunch of stuff. Very good deals. I got lots and lots of meat. Um, I spent almost $300, but I saved $105, which is a great savings. Um, when we get home, I'll film what I got with the prices. It was unbelievable in there um not bad of a drive especially when you have a clear day and i don't know if you can tell behind me but um yeah it's uh we have no snow on the ground it rained overnight um don't know if we'll have a white christmas or a green christmas this year so uh that's where we're at on that um we're gonna head for home my little pilot here he's like mom put it all in the back so I couldn't check it all out put it in the back of the truck so it stays cooler um, but I did get some really good deals um, pork loins a whole pork loin for six bucks um, pork butts I got two huge pork butts which I could probably cut those down and get four out of them um, a big 10 pound tube of burger that I'll have to, you know, and I don't mind processing it. I got a ribeye loin or what, what's it called? Ribeye something. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, a ribeye rib loin that I'll cut down into steaks. Probably about an inch thick, I think. Um, and then, then I can put those in the uh, smaller bags and and make the bags so they're uh, ready to just pull de thaw and cook for dinner for for the family so um, so if you're into going shopping and then processing the the big loins and stuff down into and putting them into package sizes that would work for your family this is the place to come um, they have a Facebook page uh, Freddy's Market or Freddy's Family Market sorry which happens to be also the Marathon gas station in Atlanta Michigan so uh, no wonder why I drove by it the first time because they don't have a huge sign out front they have a sign on the side of the building but it's covered up by the ice stress so uh, it was a good trip over here because the weather's beautiful um, but definitely I think at least like once a month come over here and and restock with me would be a great thing so um so yeah uh i could see coming over here once a month and not doing any shopping other than the bare essentials that i would need in gaylord so uh, we'll see about that i don't know but when we get back home and i get everything in the house i'll video what i got and show you um some really really good deals like i said saved 105 dollars, 106 bucks i think let's see yeah 105.92 106 dollars so um <clears throat> definitely a good place to come glad i did come today um we're stocked with meat for a while because i have a huge chest freezer downstairs um that was a score that was a score for a good deed i did one day um God was looking out for me that day. Uh, so we'll see you when we get back home. 
Do you want to say anything to him? Hmm? You want to say anything to him there, buddy? Okay, okay, we're, we're going to have more meat snacks on the way home. Yeah? Okay, Colt says see you when we get home. All right, we're home. So, in my haul today, I got two pork butts for 30 bucks. I got a 10 pound sleeve of burger for 50 bucks. I got two big pork loins. That one's six dollars. That one's 10. I got a beef tender loin for $41. These brats, there's five in a package. I got six packages, dollar each. Bacon, these are one pound packages. They're a, it's called a steak cut. Don't know, they'll be good. These were a dollar each. I got three pork tenderloins. That one was four bucks, four bucks, four bucks. And then I got a whole ribeye loin, which I'm gonna cut into steaks for $53. And then I got three boxes of Bob Evans pre-made patties, 30 packages in each box, $5 per box. And then I got four things of cheese. It was buy one, get one free. Can't beat that. And then I got a few odd and end things that I needed for the house too. So that was our haul from Freddy's Family Market in Atlanta, Gillard. Again, I spent just under $300, but I saved $106. So not a bad day for a little drive on a not so bad weather day. Thanks for watching. All right, I got the two pork loins processed. There's two bags, so that makes two meals per pile. So I've got eight meals processed. I'm gonna take those to the freezer, and then we're gonna start on that pork butt over there. Well, there's two there. I'm thinking the size of them, I'd probably get four meals out of them. All right, we're back. Um, as I figured, I cut those two pork butts into four. So now we have four crock pot meals. Taking them to the freezer. All right, um, the beef loin I cut into half. So I have two meals there. I've cut up the ribeye loin. So I have three packages that have three steaks in each. And then that back package back there has four steaks. So that makes four meals. Now for the 10 pound thing of burger. Let's get the others into the freezer first. All right, five bags with burger in it. Food is, all the food I bought, me, I bought anyway, is prepped in bags and ready to go. So these five will join everything else down into the freezer and uh, we'll eat meat for a while. Yeehaw. All right, so I figured I'd bring you down and show you everything's in the freezer. This pork tenderloin will be Christmas dinner. But yeah, we got lots of meat now. Nummy, nummy. Thanks for watching, guys. Stick around. You never know what I'll be sh up to next.